The Romania national football team Romanian, Echipa Națională de Fotbal a Romaniei represents Romania in international football and is controlled by the Romanian Football Federation. They are colloquially known as tricolori the tricolors. Romania is one of the only four national teams from Europe, the other three being Yugoslavia, France, and Belgium, that took part in the first FIFA World Cup in 1930. Since that performance, Romania have qualified for the 1934, 1938, 1970, 1990, 1994 and 1998 editions. Led by playmaker Gheorghe Hagi, the team's finest hour came in 1994 when it reached the quarter-finals. They were eliminated by Sweden on a penalty shootout after having previously defeated Argentina. At the European Championships, Romania's best performance was in 2000 when they advanced to the quarter-finals from a group with Germany, Portugal and England, before falling to eventual runners-up Italy. They also reached the last eight in 1960 and 1972, and qualified for the 1984, 1996, 2008 and 2016 tournaments. History Early years The Romanian Football Federation Federația Romana de Fotbal was established in October 1909 in Bucharest. Romania played their first international match on 8 June 1922, a 2-1 win over Yugoslavia in Belgrade, being coached by Tiafil Moraru. Several temporary coaches were employed, before Moraru resumed control in August 1924, managing the side for nearly four years. Romania enjoyed some success during the 1930s. Manager Castel Radulescu took them to the first three FIFA World Cup tournaments, a feat matched only by Brazil, Belgium, and France. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> World Cups in the 1930s. At the 1930 World Cup, Romania won their first match against Peru, 3–1, with goals from Adalbert Dezu, Constantine Stanciu and Nikolai Kovac and Samuel Zauber as goalkeeper, before being thrashed 4–0 by hosts and eventual winners Uruguay. Romania qualified for the next World Cup in 1934 after beating Yugoslavia 2–1 in a repeat of their first international. At the finals, Romania played only one game in a new knockout format, losing 2-1 to Czechoslovakia in Trieste, Italy, with Stefan de Bay scoring their only goal of the tournament. Romania qualified by default for the 1938 World Cup after their qualifying playoff opponents Egypt withdrew. They suffered a shock defeat in the finals in France, losing to Minos Cuba, who, like Romania, had only qualified due to the withdrawal of their qualifying opponents, the United States. The first match at the Stade Chapeau in Toulouse ended 3-3 after extra time, but Cuba won the replay four days later 2-1. <inaudible> <inaudible> Participation in the World Cup was finally achieved once again in 1970 in Mexico, although qualification came on the back of a 3–0 thrashing by Portugal in Lisbon and two unconvincing draws against Unfancied Greece. Angelo Nicolescu's promising side were given the toughest of draws, in Group 3 with holders England, Giants Brazil and Czechoslovakia. A Jeff Hurst goal gave England a narrow victory in Romania's first match at the Estadio Jalisco in Guadalajara. Chances were improved with a 2-1 win over the Czechs. Despite going behind early to a Ladislav Petra's goal, Romania turned it around after half-time with Alexandru Niagu and Floria Dumitrash scoring to give them two vital points. Even then, only a win over the excellent Brazilians would take them into the quarter-finals. There were rumours before the match that Brazil might prefer Romania to progress than world champions England, despite beating them 1-0 in their previous match in Guadalajara, the South American giants still viewed England as one of its biggest obstacles to tournament victory. But Brazil played some of the best football of the competition, with Pelé scoring twice and a Jairzinho goal in between. Romania battled bravely, Dumitrash pulled the score back to 2-1 before the break and a late Emmerich Dombrowski goal made it 3-2, but they were out. Topic: 1972-1978 
On 26 September 1973, under new coach Valentin Stanescu, Romania suffered a significant defeat to East Germany in Leipzig. The East Germans won 2–0 to effectively seal their first ever qualification for the World Cup, which would be held over the border in West Germany. With East Germany scoring a predictable 4–1 win in Albania, Romania were out, despite a huge 9–0 win over Finland in Bucharest. Romania continued to suffer poor form in the UEFA European Championship. In their qualifying group for the 1976 European Football Championship, they were out-qualified by Spain despite an impressive 1–1 draw in the away match. Romania failed to win matches, drawing twice with Scotland and Spain and dropping points in Denmark with a dismal goalless draw. Romania were again beaten by Spain for a place in the 1978 World Cup in Argentina. Despite a 1–0 win in Bucharest, Romania lost a bizarre match at home to Yugoslavia 6–4 having led 3–2 at half-time. Spain won 1–0 in Belgrade to seal passage to South America. Topic: 1984 European Championship. Romania's sole successful qualifying campaign between 1970 and 1990 was for the European Championships in 1984 in France. At the finals, Romania were drawn with regular rivals Spain, holders West Germany, and dark horses Portugal. Under head coach Mircea Lucescu, an encouraging opening game in Saint Etienne saw them draw with the Spanish. Francisco José Carrasco opened the scoring from the penalty spot but Romania equalized before half-time with a goal from Laszlo Bologna. Against the Germans in Lens, Marcel Corres scored an equalizer in the first minute of the second half in response to Rudy Voller's opener, but Voller would score a winning goal. Their last match in Nantes was a must-win match, but Nene's late winner meant Portugal progressed with Spain, who netted a dramatic late winner against West Germany at the Parc des Princes in Paris. Romania stuttered throughout the rest of the decade, but a stronger squad at the end of the decade saw them qualify for their fifth World Cup in 1990. A win over Denmark in their last match took Emmerich Genet's side to the finals for the first time in 20 years. 2010 Golden Team era Topic. 1990 World Cup Romania's squad was entirely domestic-based, despite an increasing trend for the major sides in Italy and Spain buying up the best foreign talent. Midfielder Ili Dumitrescu, striker Florin Reducioiu and genius playmaker Gheorghe Hagi, were in the squad. With world champions Argentina stunned by Cameroon in the tournament's opening match, Romania did their chances no harm with a convincing win over the Soviet Union at the San Nicola in Bari, with Marius Lakatis scoring in each half. The result was all the more impressive given the absence of Hagi. There was controversy, however, as Lakatis's second was a penalty given for a handball by Vajas Kediatulan that television replays clearly showed to be some way outside the penalty area. Romania were the next victims of Cameroon in Bari. Cult hero Roger Mila, 38 years of age, came on as a substitute for Emmanuel Maboang Kesak and scored twice before Gavril Balint pulled one back. Romania needed a point in their last match against improving Argentina at the San Paolo in Naples. Pedro Monzon gave Argentina the lead after an hour, but Balint quickly equalized and Romania held on to reach round two. Against Jack Charlton's Republic of Ireland side in Genoa, Romania did not have the quality to break down a defensive opposition. Daniel Timoft was the only player to miss in the penalty shootout, his kick saved by Packy Bonner, and Romania were out. 1994 World Cup Romania missed out on Euro 1992. Scotland qualified after Romania drew a must-win last match in Sofia against Bulgaria, with Nasko Sorokov's equaliser sealing their fate. Romania was successful, however, in reaching another World Cup in the United States in 1994. Despite losing in Belgium and suffering a heavy 5-2 defeat in Czechoslovakia, Romania went into their last match at Cardiff Arms Park with Wales needing a win to pip them to a place in the finals. Goals from Gheorghe Hagi and Dean Saunders meant the game was finely balanced, before Wales were awarded a penalty. 
Paul Bowden of Swindon Town stepped up but hit the woodwork and Romania went on to win 2–1, Florin Reducioiu's late goal proving unnecessary as Czechoslovakia dropped a point in Belgium and were eliminated. At the finals, Romania were one of the most entertaining teams in the early stages, with Gheorghe Hagi, Florin Reducioiu and Ili Dumitrescu on form. Romania beat Colombia at the Pasadena Rose Bowl in Los Angeles 3–1. All but one of Romania's games took place in California, and they were awarded the advantage of playing most of their games in Los Angeles. Reducioyu opened the scoring before Hagi scored a spectacular second from wide on the left touchline. Adolfo Valencia pulled one back with a headed goal just before half-time, but Romania held on and Reducioyu sealed the win with a late third. In Detroit's indoor Pontiac Silverdome, the temperature soared due to the greenhouse effect in the indoor arena. Switzerland, acclimatized after having already played the hosts there, outran Romania in the second half and turned a 1-1 half-time score into a surprising 4-1 win. Romania responded by beating the hosts 1-0 in Pasadena with an early Dan Petrescu goal. In the round of 16 knockout stage they faced Argentina in Los Angeles who were shorn of Diego Maradona who was thrown out of the tournament for taking drugs. Reducioyu, suspended, was hardly missed, as coach Angel Iordanescu pushed Dumitrescu forward to play as a striker and the player responded by scoring twice in the first 20 minutes, won a superbly subtle left foot flick from a right-wing haggy cross slotted between the Argentine defenders. In between, Gabriel Batistuta scored a penalty, but after half-time Romania netted a superb third on the counterattack, with Hagi beating goalkeeper Luis Ila. Abel Balbo pulled one back, but Romania held on for a shock win. Romania would suffer penalty heartbreak again, in the quarterfinal against Sweden in San Francisco. With just 13 minutes to play, a tight match opened up as Sweden's Thomas Brolin scored from a clever free kick move, the ball passed outside the Romanian wall by Hakan Mild for Brolin to smash in. Iordanescu threw caution to the wind and the returning Reducioyu found a late equaliser, again from a free kick move but this time down to a deflection and a failure of the Swedes to clear. In extra time Reducioyu scored again after a mistake by Patrick Andersson, but Sweden then scored their own late equaliser as giant striker Kenneth Andersson climbed above goalkeeper Florin Prunea to head home a long ball. Prunea had come in after two matches to replace Bogdan Stelia, whose confidence was shattered by the 4-1 loss to the Swiss. In the shootout, Dan Petrescu and Miodrag Belodidici had their kicks saved by Thomas Rivelli and Sweden went through. Topic. Euro 1996 At Euro 1996, held in England, Romania arrived as a highly thought of and popular team but had a nightmare. Iordanescu's side were based in the North East, with their first two games at St. James's Park in Newcastle. Against France, they lost to a Christophe Dugary header reminiscent of Kenneth Anderson's two years earlier, beating the goalkeeper to a lofted through ball. An early goal from Bulgaria striker Risto Stoikov at St. James's Park put Romania on the back foot in Euro 1996, but Doranil Muntianu appeared to have kept Romania in the match, and in the tournament, with a thunderbolt that hit the bar, bounced over the line, and back out. Referee Peter Mikkelsen merely waved play on, however, and Romania went on to lose the game 1-0 a defeat which sent them out of the tournament. English manager Harry Redknapp was in the crowd that day, and later said that it convinced him there and then that goal line technology was needed in football. Romania finally scored in their last game, Florin Reducioyu equalizing an early goal by Spain's Javier Manjaran. Spain had to win to qualify with France at the expense of Bulgaria and did so when Guillermo Amor stooped to head a late winner. Romania exited in total shame, with no points and tons of regrets of what could have been. Topic: 1998 World Cup. Despite a poor performance at Euro 1996, Romania impressed in qualifying, finishing 10 points clear of the Republic of Ireland, and were seeded for the final tournament of the 1998 World Cup thanks to their strong showing in 1994. Despite being drawn in a group with England, progression to the next round was expected in light of a declining Colombia and Minos Tunisia. Adrian Illy scored the only goal with a fine chip in their first match against Colombia at Lyon Stade Gerland. 
In Toulouse, they met an England side starting with prodigal striker Michael Owen on the bench, with Teddy Sheringham preferred alongside Alan Shearer. A mistake by Tony Adams was punished by Vural Moldovan, who played for Coventry City, before Owen came on to claim an equaliser. But Romania won with a wonderful late goal from Dan Petrescu, also playing in England with Chelsea, fighting off his club teammate Graham Lasso and nutmegging goalkeeper David Seaman. The next match was against Tunisia. Romania decided to bleach their hair before the match. Despite england Colombia being the more decisive game, the Stade de France in Paris was an 80,000-strong sell-out and the crowd were nearly rewarded with a shock as Skander Suaya scored an early penalty to give the North Africans the lead. Romania needed a point to win the group and, crucially, avoid Argentina in the round of 16, and got it when Moldovan volleyed a late equaliser. It did them little good, however, as in the round of 16 match at Bordeaux against Croatia, Davr Suka scored a twice-taken penalty to eliminate Romania. <laughs> Euro 2000 Romania had a strong qualifying campaign, winning a tough Group 7 with Portugal, Slovakia, Hungary, Azerbaijan and Liechtenstein. The Romanians impressed, never losing and winning seven times, including a big upset in Porto after defeating Portugal thanks to a late goal scored by Doran Muntianu. In Bucharest, the score finished 1-1. At Euro 2000, held in Belgium and the Netherlands, Romania was facing a very difficult group against 1996 champions Germany, semi-finalists England and Portugal. The chances for the Romanians to qualify through quarter-finals were seen as slim. Romania, however, started brightly against the Germans in Liege, with Vioral Moldovan scoring from close range. A long-range Mehmet Scholl equaliser meant they had to be content with a point and their position looked shaky after Castina headed a last-minute winner for Portugal in their second match. Emmerich Jenné, back as coach, threw caution to the wind in the last match in Charleroi against England, a match which Romania had to win. Defender Christian Chivu's cross went in off the post in the 22nd minute but, despite Romania dominating, England led at half-time through an Alan Shearer penalty and a late Michael Owen goal after he rounded goalkeeper Bogdan Stelia to score a tap-in, both in the last five minutes of the half. Romania attacked after the break and were quickly rewarded, Doranil Muntianu punishing a poor punch from Nigel Martin, a late replacement for injured goalkeeper David Seaman, to equalise three minutes after the restart. England cracked under the pressure. Unable to retain possession or pose an attacking threat, they fell deep and late on Phil Neville, playing out of position at left back, conceded a penalty scored by Johan Ganea in the 89th minute. Romania's relief was tempered by tough opposition in the last eight, and Italy, who would end up seconds from being crowned European champions in an agonising final, comfortably saw them off 2-0 in Brussels. Francesco Totti and Filippo Inzaghi scoring towards the end of the first half. In the 35th minute, Jorge Hagi, in his final international tournament, hit the woodwork with goalkeeper Francesco Toldo stranded off his line and, after the break, was sent off for diving. Romania's tournament was over and Emmerich Jenné left his job as coach again. Topic: 2000s near misses. Romania failed to qualify for the next 3 major tournaments. They drew Slovenia, who had been surprise qualifiers for Euro 2000 in a playoff for a place in the 2002 World Cup in South Korea and Japan. A narrow 2-1 deficit, having led through a Marius Nikoli goal, after the first leg in Ljubljana was not irretrievable. With fans hero Gheorghe Hagi now coaching the side, they were confident of getting the win they needed in Bucharest against the Balkan upstarts, but Slovenia took the lead before the hour through Miladin Rudanha. Right wing back Kosmin Contra quickly equalised, but Romania could not find the goal they needed to force extra time, and Slovenia, with Maverick manager Sreko Katanic, were in a major tournament again. Topic <laughs> Euro 2004. Romania were confident of qualifying for the tournament, drawn in Group 2 with seeds Denmark, Norway, Bosnia and Herzegovina and Minos Luxembourg, with Angel Iordanescu back as coach. Despite a good start, a 3-0 win away to Bosnia in Sarajevo, Romania stuttered. 
Stefan Iversen's late goal gave Norway a surprise win in Bucharest and they were stunned at home by the Danes, 5–2, with Thomas Gravesen scoring a spectacular goal from around 50 yards out, despite leading twice. They recovered slightly, completing a double over the Bosnians and earning a point in Oslo, but conceded a cutting injury time equaliser in Denmark to draw 2–2. It was decisive, as they now required Norway to fail to win at home to Luxembourg to stand any realistic chance of qualifying. Eventually, the Danes got a point in Bosnia to scrape through a tight group, with Norway going to a playoff with Spain. Topic. 2006 World Cup Romania were put in a difficult group for the qualifying tournament for the 2006 World Cup in Germany, the Netherlands and the Czech Republic were favourites to qualify, then ranked first and second in Europe respectively. Early wins over Finland and Macedonia were unconvincing, and they were some way behind the two leaders by the time they earned a good 2-0 home win over the Czechs. Despite a record of eight wins, three losses and one draw, they finished third behind the Dutch and the Czechs and missed out on another major tournament. 2008. Euro 2008 Romania were drawn in a group with group favourites the Netherlands and tough opponents Bulgaria for Euro 2008 qualifying. Romania, however, had a good qualifying campaign, losing only away against Bulgaria and beating the Netherlands 1–0 at home with a goal scored by Doran Goyan from a suspicious offside position not seen by referee Kairos Viserys. On 17 October 2007, Romania became the fourth team to qualify for Euro 2008, the nation's first international tournament since Euro 2000. Coincidentally, Viktor Piterka also led Romania to qualification for Euro 2000, only to sit back and let Emmerich Jene coach the team in the final tournament. This time, however, he stayed in the role, the first time he coached a national team in the final stages of a tournament. Romania was drawn in the so-called group of death. Alongside the Netherlands, world champions Italy and France, runners-up in the 2006 World Cup. Romania started with a 0–0 draw against a lackluster France while Italy were soundly beaten by the Netherlands, 3–0. In their next match, against Italy, Adrian Mutu opened the scoring early in the second half. Their lead was a very short one, however, as Italy's Christian Panucci scored a minute later off of a corner kick. Nearing the end of the match, Daniel Nicoli earned a penalty for his team, but goalkeeper Gianluigi Buffon saved the subsequent Mutu penalty, leaving Romania with two points and needing a win against the Netherlands, which eliminated France 4-1 that same evening. The Netherlands beat Romania 2-0 in the final game of the group, which meant that Italy joined the Netherlands in the quarter-finals and Romania finished third, ahead of France. Topic. 2010 World Cup Romania were drawn into the UEFA qualifying round for the 2010 World Cup alongside France, Serbia, Austria, Lithuania and the Faroe Islands. Although Romania were seeded in the second pot, suggesting that they were a strong challenge for the first place in the group, they eventually finished fifth, above only the Faroe Islands. Their campaign was a disaster that began with a 3-0 home loss to Lithuania and included a 5-0 trashing in Belgrade by Serbia. Furthermore, various problems were caused during the poor campaign, such as the retirement from international football of Kosmin Contra, Miral Rudoy and Adrian Mutu the latter would later be recalled after a year's absence. Also, coach Viktor Piterka resigned and was replaced by Razvan Lekescu. 2012. In Euro 2012 qualifying, Romania was drawn into Group D along with France, Bosnia and Herzegovina, Belarus, Albania and Luxembourg. Although the team initially seemed prepared to continue their awful form from their disastrous World Cup campaign, beginning with a 1-1 draw with pot five members Albania and following up with a goalless draw with Belarus and a pair of losses to France and Bosnia and Herzegovina, the team was able to rebound somewhat and register their first two victories. The first was an expected win against Luxembourg but the second was an important win in the rematch against Bosnia and Herzegovina. Romania's last good result came when they battled group favourite France to a goalless draw before ending the campaign the way it began, two disappointing draws with Albania and Belarus. 
They finished qualification in a distant third place and only one point ahead of Belarus. Topic: 2014 World Cup. Romania was drawn into the 2014 FIFA World Cup qualifying round with the Netherlands, Turkey, Hungary, Estonia and Andorra. Romania, Turkey and Hungary were expected to battle it out for second place behind the Netherlands. They made an impressive start with a 2-0 away win in Estonia followed by a 4-0 win at home against Modest Andorra and another away win in Turkey 1-0. After that, Romania was defeated by Netherlands, both at home and away, and managed to secure only a draw in Hungary, in between. Romania started the last part of the campaign with a victory at home, against Hungary, but was defeated by Turkey. The last two match days were decisive, with Romania securing its place in the playoff with two wins, against Andorra and Estonia, while qualification rivals Turkey and Hungary were both defeated by the winner of the group, the Netherlands. Romania were drawn to play Greece for a place in the World Cup finals, but a 3-1 loss in Greece and a 1-1 home draw ended its run. Topic: Euro 2016. For the qualifying stage of the Euro 2016, Romania was drawn into Group F along with Greece, Hungary, Finland, Northern Ireland and the Faroe Islands. Romania began its first successful qualification campaign since 2008 with a win over group favourites Greece before following up with a 1–1 draw with POT2 member Hungary and a 2–0 win over Finland. Despite the initial success, Romania decided to part with coach Victor Piterka by mutual consent. Angel Iordanescu came out of retirement to return to coach Romania for a third time. Under Iordanescu, Romania was able to follow up with comfortable 2-0 win over surprise force Northern Ireland and, despite a disappointing 1-0 win over the Faroe Islands and a 0-0 draw in the return game against Northern Ireland, Romania remained on top of Group F, one point above Northern Ireland and three points above third-placed Hungary. After a goalless draw in the match against Hungary in Budapest, however, the team fell back on the second place, one point behind Northern Ireland and three above Hungary, still placed third. Following a 1-1 draw clinched in overtime at home against Finland, Romania secured their spot at the final tournament in the last game after a confident 3-0 win in the Faroe Islands. Romania finished the qualification group second, one point behind group winners Northern Ireland, completing their first successful qualification campaign in eight years undefeated after five wins and five draws. Romania advanced to Euro 2016 and were drawn in the same group as tournament hosts France, Switzerland and Albania. Romania was defeated by France thanks to a 89th-minute strike by Dimitri Payet to cancel out Bogdan Stanku's equaliser as Romania dropped last in Group A in its second group match, against Switzerland. Another Stanku penalty helped Romania claim its first point of the tournament after a 1-1 draw. In its last group stage match, Romania lost 0-1 against Albania to finish last in Group A, with only one point and two goals scored, both from penalties. Topic: 2018 World Cup. For the qualification round, Romania was drawn in Group E, being in Pot One for the first time after a long time. Romania's two strongest opponents appear to be Denmark and Poland. Its other opponents are Montenegro, Armenia, and Kazakhstan. The qualifying campaign started with a 1-1 home draw against Montenegro, followed by a thrashing away victory against Armenia, 0-5. In the next match, Romania recorded another draw 0-0 against Kazakhstan. The last match played in 2016 was a 0-3 defeat against Poland, with Robert Lewandowski scoring a double. After an uninspiring campaign, Romania ended in the fourth place in Group E with 13 points. After eight of the ten games, due to lackluster performances, coach Christoph Dom was fired and replaced with a promising new coach, Kosmin Contra. Stadium The Romania national team plays its home games at Arena Nationala, the biggest stadium in the country, built in 2011 and with a capacity of 55,600 seats. 
The National Stadium is a Category 4 venue and, as such, it hosted the 2011–12 UEFA Europa League final. Some friendly matches or minor FIFA World Cup and UEFA European Football Championship qualification matches are played at other venues. Former National Stadium which held 60,120 seats was completely demolished at the end of 2007. The last football match played was a 6-1 win against Albania on 21 November 2007. Honours <laughs> 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 FIFA World Cup Quarterfinal 1 1994 Round of 16 4 1934 1938 1990 1998 UEFA European Football Championship Quarterfinal 3 1960 1972 2000 Football at the Summer Olympics Quarterfinal 1 1964 Round of 16 1 1924 Balkan Cup Winners 4 record 1929 to 31 1933 1936 1977 to 80 Runners up 1 1973 to 76 Topic Kit suppliers Romania's kit are currently supplied by Spanish company Joma, which replaced Adidas, which itself replaced Le Coq Sportif in 1984. In 2017 the Romanian Football Federation announced its first brand identity and a new kit. The new emblem references the coat of arms of all five Romanian provinces with the intention to symbolize the unity of Romania. The kit is available in three main colors, red, yellow, and blue. All kits have Impriuna Suntem Fotbol. Together, we are football. Printed on the inside of the collar. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Media coverage. Romania's Nations League qualifying matches and friendlies are currently televised on Pro TV through 2022. Between 2008 and 2014, Antena 1 had the rights to broadcast Romania's home games, friendlies, and qualifiers. In 2014-2018, the Romania's qualifying matches to UEFA Euro and World Cup plus two pre-Euro and one post-Euro friendly matches are taken over TVR and the friendly matches that are not broadcast by TVR also taken over by Pro TV. Starting from March 2019, Pro TV has take over the Romania's qualifying matches from TVR because Pro TV has bought all Romania fixtures previously effective broadcast per September 2018. Competitive record World Cup record Champions runners up third place fourth place Asterisk asterisk denotes draws including knockout matches decided on penalty kicks. Darker color indicates win, normal color indicates loss. Topic: European Championship. Asterisk denotes draws, including knockout matches decided on penalty kicks. Asterisk asterisk red border color indicates tournament was held on home soil. Topic: Summer Olympics. Football at the Summer Olympics was first played officially in 1908. The Olympiads between 1896 and 1980 was only open for amateur players. The 1984 and 1988 tournaments were open to players with no appearances in the FIFA World Cup. After the 1988 Olympics, the football event was changed into a tournament for U23 or U21 teams with a maximum of three older players. See National Under-21 Football Team for competition record from 1992 until present day. Topic Schedule Topic FIFA World Cup twenty eighteen qualifying
Topic: <laughs> UEFA Euro 2020 qualifying. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Results and fixtures. Win. Draw. Loss. Topic 2018. Topic Coaching Staff. Topic Players. Topic Current Squad. The following players were called up for the UEFA Nations League games against Lithuania and Montenegro on 17 and 20 November 2018 respectively, caps and goals as of 20 November 2018 after the match against Montenegro. <laughs> Recent call-ups The following players have been called up for the team within the last 12 months. Notesing equals player withdrew from the squad due to an injury. Ret equals player who retired from national team. Equals. Topic: Most capped players. Equals. As of the 15th of June 2016, the 10 players with the most caps for Romania are players in bold are still active, at least at club level. Equals. Topic: Top goal scorers. Equals. As of the 14th of November 2014, the 10 players with the most goals for Romania are. Players in bold are still active, at least at club level. Topic: Youngest debutants. As of 7 June 2014, the five youngest debutants for Romania are Managers Romania national team head-to-head Last match updated was against Montenegro on 20 November 2018 equals equals see also